Hey, guys, I am back with another video, and happy Sunday. So, yeah, crossovers and things are great. We got a crossover with Cartoon Network shows like Billy and Mandy, crossover code name Kids Next Door. Um... Family Guy crossover The Simpsons. Uh. Okay, KO crossover Sonic the Hedgehog, Ben 10, Steven Universe, Teen Titans Go. Uh. For some weird reason, Mighty Magic Source did one with, um. With Okay, KO, but it was not fully a crossover because it was a cameo, you know. Rad from OKKO OK had a cameo in one of the episodes. And, um, well, The Simpsons crossover Futurama. But the weirdest crossover ever I have seen was like Scooby Doo crossover WWE, Steven, Steven Universe crossover Uncle Grandpa. Um, the Powerpuff Girls, which technically was not a crossover because I don't know why Cartoon Network actually did this, but there was a little bit of a tiny, tiny reference of Cartman, you know, Eric Cartman from South Park, and I can't believe Cartoon Network got away with that, so they don't make uh, comedy central mad, and... Uh, the other crossover was, um, Supernatural crossover Scooby-Doo. Remember, er, they had that episode where Dean and Sam was trapped in an episode of Scooby-Doo. But the one that is the weirdest of them all was Power Rangers crossover Street Fighter. Now, I saw a an action figure of one of the characters. I think it was Cammy in her Power Rangers outfit like a long time ago in GameStop. Around like a year ago. So, yeah, if y'all remember the video game Power Rangers Battle of the Grid, it was an app at first, then they released it on consoles like Xbox One, PS4, Nintendo Switch. They did a crossover with Street Fighter. You only get to play four characters like Ryu, Chun-Li, Kami, and Guile. And then, whatever weird reason, a Ryu Ranger to be a Power Rangers member. Now, I don't know if this was a DLC, but I know it was a, an event on the app. Never played the game, but... Power Rangers Battle of the Grid, like I said, remember when I said it was released on Xbox, PS4, and Nintendo Switch? They had it, the event to be a viable DLC. And I just found it really weird. Now, if you think the Scooby-Doo crossover WWE movies was weird, 